Hey, today I'm going to be showing you how to install games such as Pokemon or other Game Boy titles on your TI-84 Plus CE graphing calculator. So first things first, let's first go over what you're going to need to do this. So first you're going to need a computer. Uh, this is so that you can use the USB port on your computer to access uh, these files off the internet. And we're also going to need a TI-84 Plus CE graphing calculator. And you're also going to need the cable that comes with it so that you can plug it in your calculator and in your computer. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to take your USB cable and plug it into your computer. And then take the other end and plug it into the small charging port on the side of your calculator right here. It's done, this little light should be on and your uh, calculator will be connected to your computer. So the first thing that you're gonna have to do is you're gonna wanna go into Internet Explorer or Google Chrome, whichever works for you. Um, and you're gonna need to go to TI Connect CE software. Just search it up, you'll find the link. So you're gonna need to download this right here. This is the program that connects your calculator to your PC so you can modify the data files and export files to your calculator. So you're going to want to go over to the side and you're going to see if you have a Mac, you're going to want to go here, but if you have Windows, you're going to want to go here. So I have Windows, so I would download here. So we've already downloaded it. You, you want to click the exe file right here. So you would click that. It would install and you'd have a setup wizard. So I'm going to do that just for demonstration purposes. All right, so when you're done, it's going to say here, you're going to want to open this file uh, and you're going to want to, you're going to want to allow it to make changes to your desktop. So this is the startup wizard. So because I've already installed it, it's going to say, you know, I can remove it or modify or repair it. But once you've already, it'll say like, oh, uh, install it here and you're going to just click OK and it'll start installing. Once it's done installing, you will have um, a uh, icon called PI Connect CE. It's this one right here. So this obviously is essential, like I said before, to actually putting stuff on your calculator. Okay, so now that you have TI Connect CE installed, you're going to want to install your Game Boy emulator. So you're going to want to go into your internet browser, and if you search up, I have a link in the description, there's a website that contains a file for a emulator that someone made for the Game Boy that works on the TI-84 calculator. So you're going to want to come down to TI Boy CE Alpha version 0.1.3 zip. You're going to want to hit the zip file, which is this. And once that installs, you're going to want to show it in folder, and then there's the folder that has the file. So you want to open this, and what you need right now is you need the ROM generator. This is very important because oopsie, the ROM generator is what turns your Game Boy files into actual usable playable ROMs. So you're going to want to grab this and put this on your desktop for now. Mine's already on it, so not important. Mine's right here. So you need that to turn game files into ROMs. Okay, now that you have your ROM, installed, you're going to want to keep this folder minimized because you're going to need this later. So now what you want to do is you want to go to romsmania.com. This is a website that has tons and tons of ROMs for all types of different platforms. What you're going to be looking for is Game Boy games specifically. So in this case, I'll be installing Pokemon Yellow. So you can search up your game in the ROM search bar. And then you're going to want to click on it, 
and you're not gonna want, don't hit download don't hit download right here what you want to hit is you want to hit more options and you want to download through your browser this just works the best it's a little bit slower but not really but it makes it all really easy and convenient to put on a calculator so you want to do that and see mine's already done so it doesn't really matter because Game Boy games are very small to begin with so what you're going to want to do is then once you're done with that you can open your folder that has Pokemon Yellow in it and you can minimize your web browser. And you want to open the folder and you want to grab this GBC file and you want to put it on your desktop. Now, here comes the interesting part. Now that you have Pokemon Yellow and your Game Boy ROM emulator, you want to take Pokemon Yellow or whatever game you have and you want to put it inside of T-Boy C because this basically turns it into usable ROM for your calculator. So you want to enter the game title display in the ROM list. This makes it so that when you're looking through your program, you can see the names of the games. This is what it'll show up as so you know what game So you want to usually just type in the name of the game. And now you see there are different options. You need the TI3 Premium CE or TI84 Plus CE. You're going to want to use TI84 Plus CE bundle because that's what you have. So what you want to do is you want to hit the number 3 and then hit enter. And now you have to enter the prefix name. This is just so the files have a name and it has a 5 character max. So I would just call it like yellow or something. But you always have to have a capital letter. Sorry. Just forgot. Alright. So now it says enter to exit, I already wrote all the code, so you can exit it. And now you have this file right here on your desktop that is a TI-84 file. So you can put it right here with the rest of your game. Now you will install the games on your calculator. To install the games on your calculator, you want to make sure that your calculator is plugged into your computer, which earlier we already have done that, so that should be good. So you're going to open TI Connect CE and you're going to go down to this little image of the files and this is your calculator and this is all the files on it and as you can see I already have Pokemon Blue, etc. So now what you want to do is you want to take your folder from earlier that has the TI-84 uh, Game Boy files, because now you need them. So you want to select TI Boy Skin, TI Boy Dat, and TI Boy CE. You don't need ROM gen. You need these files, and you're going to want to take them and drag them to your desktop. And then, once you've done that, you're going to want to take them and you're going to want to drag them into your calculator. And so, as you can see, you have your list. And this is all fine with archives and the way it is. You just want to hit send. I hate cancel just because I already have them installed. But you're going to want to hit send, and once you've hit send, uh, it should be in your calculator. Now what you can do is you can take your game file, and you can put that in your calculator. You just want to hit send. It'll be sending files of the game to your calculator. Don't unplug your calculator while this is happening. And then once it's finished, You can see that there are files for yellow, because that's the game file name that I gave it, in my calculator. So now you can close out of TI Connect, and you can close out of your internet browser, and you can close all your stuff that you had open. None of that is important anymore. Uh, and now I will show you how to access all this on your calculator. So now that you've finished with all the installation, you can go take your calculator and you can unplug it from your computer. 
and then, as you can see, your calculator is already on. So what you want to do is to access your games, you want to hit this program button right here. When you hit program, you will see one of your programs is called TI Boy CE. You're going to want to use the arrow keys if it's not already selected to select it. And you're going to want to hit enter. Then you're going to hit enter again. And as you can see, this is the Game Boy emulator. It has all the game files that you've already installed on it. So for example, see I installed Pokemon Yellow earlier. I'm going to select Pokemon Yellow using the arrow keys down to Pokemon Yellow and then hitting enter. So this will run a completely full-fledged ROM of the actual game Pokemon Yellow. So there's no sound because it's a calculator, it doesn't have a speaker. But this is the game, so I mean, you know, uh, have fun playing with your new, essentially, Game Boy.